Am I the only one who didn't know that scientific thinking isn't just for labs? You actually use it every time you solve a problem? Yes, even fixing your toaster counts. Let's break it down. Scientific thinking isn't rocket science. Okay, sometimes it is rocket science. But mostly it's a skill anyone can use. Picture this. Your toaster stops working. First, you observe the problem. Is it plugged in? Next, you ask questions. Is the outlet dead? Then, you make a hypothesis. Maybe the fuse blew. So, you test it. Try another device or check the fuse. That's the scientific method in your kitchen. But it goes further. Reading the news? Don't just accept wild claims. Gather evidence. Compare sources and draw your own conclusions, just like a scientist. In school, teachers use experiments to help students predict, test, and analyze building critical thinking muscles for life. In business, leaders use data to challenge assumptions and make smarter decisions. Bottom line, scientific thinking is all about curiosity logic and testing ideas. It helps you make better choices, question what you hear, and grow your mind. So, next time you solve a problem, big or small, give yourself some credit. You're thinking like a scientist.